guys and welcome to Casno Gaming. I'm your host Casno. In today's episode, I'm going to be showing you how to obtain and evolve Feebas in Pokemon Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire. In the original Pokemon Ruby, Sapphire, and Emerald, Feebas was incredibly hard to find. To get one, you had to fish in one of up to six special tiles in Route 119's waters. These tiles were calculated based upon your ID number, as well as the trendy saying you set at Duford Town. This time, however, things are different. Now while fishing on Route 119, Feebas has a 5% chance of appearing with any rod. That means you can use the old rod, good rod, or the super rod to get one. This makes Feebas a lot easier to find, but still has a rare aspect to it, but there's an even easier way of obtaining it. During the daytime, if you go to this bridge under Route 119 and fish underneath it, you will have a 100% chance of finding Feebas, making Feebas a very easy Pokemon to find. Alternatively, at nighttime, if you fish around this rock in the south of Route 119, you will also get a 100% chance of finding it. This makes things extremely easy when looking for a Feebas. This also helps if you want a chain fish to get a shiny, and once you catch it, you can just find it normally by looking for it on the Dex Nav. To evolve Feebas into Milotic, you have to raise Feebas' beauty stat to maximum and level it up in battle. To raise Feebas' beauty stat, you feed it blue Pokeblocks. You can create blue Pokeblocks by using any four of the following berries. Chesto, Orin, Wiki, Bluke, Kelpsy, Corn, Palm Tray, Baloo, Pasho, Yachi, Koba, Ganlon, Apicot, or Rowap. If you like this video, leave a like. If you want to see more of my comments, subscribe. Want to see a new video in the future that I haven't done before? Leave suggestions in the comments. Also, you can click Omega Ruby to go see my Five Nights at Freddy's 3 tutorial on how to get all three stars. Or you can click Alpha Sapphire if you want to see the first episode of my Pokemon Light Platinum Nuzlocke.